Now, in today's video, we are going to be talking about ticker symbol DWAC, uh, Digital World Acquisition Corp. This this company is going literally parabolic. Went from nine dollars all the way up to about fifty bucks all during the day today, and really continue to push up here to seventy four. It sold off down to about sixty nine dollars right now. But the idea behind this thing is crazy. It's pretty much just the the Trump social media. That's what everybody is saying. This this is this company's merging with Trump media um, to create a deal for a variety a variety of things because they want to get a clone off the ground, very similar to uh, uh, Twitter called Truth, and they want everything to have all of this news outlets, all this other stuff. Um, but the, but the thing about it is this thing is already turning into one of these meme stocks where it's going to the moon. <laughs> Literally, this thing is going parabolic. So when people ask, should you buy this? I think if you're going to be buying this, it's going to be like buying a company like GameStop, like AMC, a company like that, a company that's like, hey, this thing could easily hit $100 or $120, but it also could sell off back down to about 30 or 40 or $50 or 20 or 10. The volatility, the risk level is going to be a lot higher than just a traditional stock, right? If you compare just the overall growth, 356% uh, compared to like the S&P 500, which barely gets on a good day over 2%. I think that you will understand that there's going to be a lot more risk behind this, but still some reward. And you always have to realize anytime a stock has gone up this much and you guys want to buy it, did the train already leave the station? Did did the move already happen? And I think that's where a lot of people are going to get kind of misaligned. And you guys can see this company really didn't do much uh, for the past month or so. But Honestly, it's it's one that you can see it's stair stepping its way up, and I wouldn't be surprised if the overall momentum continues tomorrow and we see a move from ninety to a hundred. Um, so, biggest question: Should you buy this for a long term play? I think that you'll probably be buying on a very very overvalued point for this company, but for a swing trade, a day trader, something more just like speculative, higher risk, you don't care, you're you're pretty much investing knowing um like okay, this thing could easily make me some money or it could virtually lose all of it. If you have that mindset behind that, you guys will be just fine. Um, and I really think there's going to be so much momentum about this. Uh, it's crazy. If we actually look at some of these news outlets, um, you guys can see kind of everything going on. Uh, making SPACs great again, Trump. So you can see it's the Trump social media. It you know had multiple circuit breaker halts today just because of the overall growth we've seen the, the markets. Um, anytime a stock surges up super fast, they will halt the stock and make sure everything kind of calms down. And then it will often continue to rally because people are just clicking that buy button and it will jump up even more. So, you know, I would not be surprised if this if this thing continues. Um, but you have to understand that there, there is some risk levels behind it, guys. Um, am I going to be buying this? I, I missed this move today because of the overall risk. I did not want to take it. I would rather, you know, I would rather wait. I might trade it in the morning more like a day trade if we have some sort of momentum breakouts. Uh, you know, and another thing too is we will see stocks like this, just like GameStop, where if we actually compare it, where the, the overall move, we'll, we'll go to the yearly chart, where it just spikes up, you know, a hundred or a hundred, you know, like a thousand percent. And at the time, literally, it went from $14 all the way up to 500. Is that going to happen tomorrow or the next week or so? No, I, I think that we'll definitely see a little bit of some continuation with it. But look how fast this thing sold off. It was like a sinking ship. Now it's slowly moving its way back up. There's been a lot of hype about this thing recently. So I think there's just a lot of momentum. I think there's some highly high risk. Long term, stay away for fun and and to make some money. Definitely just just have a little fun with it. You know, I, I wouldn't recommend going more than, you know, one or two percent behind it. Um you know what that means is for every hundred dollars you have in your account, just put, you know, 
a dollar or two or three dollars for every hundred dollars you have invested. It's a great way to stay diversified, carry the growth of it, but have risk. Understand your risk tolerance. Because if you're dumping and you're selling, you know, 50% of your portfolio into something like this, you're gonna lose money. You're you're gonna be catching that falling knife and it's you're gonna hurt yourself. So be smart with it, guys, and you guys will be all right. It, this is really cool. I'm excited to see where this thing goes. We will see you guys later. Remember to stay happy, stay positive, and stay safe out there. Take care, everyone.